Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how we can connect Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 6 to PC and how we can transfer our data. So we can actually do that without having to use the USB cable and in order to do so we need to open the settings and in the settings we want to go to connected devices and over here we have link to windows. If we go here then we will open this page where we can connect to PC for instance by using the QR code on PC. So once we tap over here, we can choose while using the app. And of course, now we need to scan the QR code that we should have on our PC. So let's switch to PC. And now on Windows, we are looking for phone link. This is the app that we can use in order to connect to your Samsung. So over here, we need to select Android. Now we need to sign in with our Microsoft account. So let's proceed. Let's press this button. Over here, you will need to click add another device if you have used phone link before. If not, then you will have an option to add a device instead. And then we should see the QR code generated on the left side over here. So now all we need to do is use our phone in order to, um, to scan the QR code. However, if on the device you already have the, um, the account linked, but you don't have a way to scan the QR code, you can still tap on linked account. So you can use, for instance, this account over here. Then you can tap add computer and then I have a QR code and now we can scan the QR code. And after that, we can just deny the improvements request. And there we go. Now we can press done over here. And now we need to wait on PC to connect to the, to the device. And this is how it should look like. We should see that we are all set. So we can press continue. Now over here we have the option to open phone link when we sign into Windows. We can just skip that as well as this thing. And now over here we have access to our photos, our apps as well. There we go. So we can see everything that we have installed on our device. So if you want to transfer something, you can simply open, for instance, a photo. And then you can save as something. So then you can save it somewhere. Or you can just simply i don't know like open it if needed just like that and that's pretty much it so this is how we can get access to our data on on pc on the other hand if you want to you can still use a usb cable if you wish to connect by using it as it's definitely causing less trouble uh, in some cases so all you need to do is use the USB cable that you are given in the box, of course, that you can that you use, for instance, for charging the device, and then simply plug everything in. So connect to PC by using the USB cable. Now over here, we need to allow access to phone data. And there we go. Now we can switch back to PC one more time. And then when you open this PC, you will find your device over here where you have your disks. And if you go there, you will find the internal storage and you have pretty much everything over here, including the camera photos over here and so on and so forth. So this is also how we can access our mobile on PC and transfer data. So if you want to move something to PC, for instance, uh, not to PC, well, if you want to transfer something to PC, then all you need to do is simply drag and drop it, for instance, to copy to desktop or the other way around in order to add it to your mobile. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.